YouTube algorithm, YouTube algorithm, YouTube algorithm. What's more important, beating the YouTube algorithm or beating cancer? The YouTube algorithm, of course, motherfucker! Welcome to Rindy vs. The World, episode number four. Today, we're going to do a little bit of exposure thanks to my therapist's advice. We're going to park our car somewhere and run far as hell away from it, get really hot and sweaty, and the further away I am from my exit plan, the more anxiety I get. As well, I wanted to talk about the YouTube algorithm in today's video. Uh, for those of you who don't know, the YouTube algorithm, the YouTube algorithm, the YouTube algorithm, the YouTube algorithm, the YouTube algorithm. I just had to get that off my chest because as many times as you say the keyword you want to actually be inside of your video, the more it gets pushed up inside of the search engine optimization. So I want my video to be the very top for the YouTube algorithm. If you want to be a real tuber like myself, I'll give you some great advice on how to get into that algorithm, the YouTube algorithm. We're going to be getting a little bit dizzy the further we get away from our car. We're going to be getting hot because we're in some motherfucking lamb costume, baby. Here are 100% lamb, wool, Egyptian cotton. I want to be getting more uh, dizzy than I, I naturally would be. So I'm going to hit up a cigar shop real quick here um, before I go into the, the wilderness and start jogging. Um, and walking probably I don't know if I'm gonna actually jog uh, I'll try I haven't ran in probably about 10 years YouTube algorithm the 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 YouTube algorithm Do you have any uh, cigars recommended for sheep? Yeah. You know, like something that looks really uh, ritzy, but like is actually cheap. Is it cheaper? I don't, I don't know what looks sheepish. I'm sorry. Have you tried any of the like the leather roast? I have not. This is a freaking awesome cigar. Here's like the smaller one. Okay. It's Our good. Logged. So good. I don't know how to make it look sheepish. That's sheepish enough for me. Dude, this is actually nauseating. Not even the dizziness from this but this tastes like I'm fucking sucking on honey. Like I hate sugar, by the way. Havana honey? Yeah, Havana honey. I always like the honey. So you do like the sweet ones? Yeah. Yeah, I like the sweet shit. Give me that sweet shit, baby. Well, that is really sweet. That's almost like not so sweet. About 10 feet away from my car right now. I'm already feeling it though. I don't know if it's a cigar or my severe paralyzing disassociation. Guess we'll find out in a little bit. Actually, we won't because the more I smoke this cigar, the more dizzy I'll get. And also, the further away I get from the car, the more dizzy I'll get. So which one is it? Is that even on? Okay. You're taking advice from a guy who literally has gotten 4,000 views or less on his last fucking video. So already, you're on the wrong video. It's likely you clicked this because search engine optimization is what big marketing geniuses use. SEO. I'm an SEO expert. It's really nothing. It's all, all you have to do for search engine optimization is you just have to put the first words of your title and the first words of your description as the same damn thing so it'll come up in the search engine. Genius. So like this video, YouTube algorithm. YouTube algorithm. I'll put that at the front of my title and I'll put it in the front of my description. Also, if you haven't noticed yet, the more times you say the word that's at the front of your title, the more it'll get picked up by the search engine optimization and the YouTube algorithm. They're looking at exactly what we're saying in our videos. They know exactly word for word what shows up. You know, the evidence is those auto-generated captions on your videos. YouTube algorithm. So if your video actually represents what you're talking about more, such as the YouTube algorithm, and it matches your title and your tags, the YouTube algorithm, then well, I know, I'm a fucking brainiac. I, went, I have a master's degree in business administration that took me about five minutes to learn. I learned this from an H3 podcast recently. Don't do anything that has to do with spooky or ghosts or anything like that. It gets shit on. Apparently, that's why my last video did so bad. Ghosts are deplorables on YouTube. But you know what? You know what I've realized? Fuck the YouTube algorithm. You know who makes the YouTube algorithm? You know who makes this shit? Us, we do, creators. Creators make the YouTube algorithm. 
So just like Napoleon, he revolutionized the form of battle. We can revolutionize the form of the YouTube algorithm. We can do it as us creators. We can go back to the simple times, 2015, 2016 YouTube, when shit was actually funny and not about do-it-yourself tutorials and fucking trash drama channels. Therefore, we make the algorithm. Make the algorithm. Start uploading real content, you stupid trash YouTubers. Start uploading something that's worth something. If you want an easy way out, if you want to get some views and some money and you don't want to actually enjoy what you make and enjoy watching what you make, what you need to do is you need to upload some Minecraft videos some or some how-to do-it-yourself tutorials because everyone searches every day how to tie a shoe, for instance. You get a free million views off that if you just put your right SEO terms in. How to tie my shoe. Just say it 5,000 times, put it in the front of your title, put it in the front of your fucking description. Make some shitty Minecraft videos for some like children. That'll get you a lot of views because that's really popular right now. TikTok is good for nothing, it's useless. Don't use TikTok, another uh, piece of advice for you. I got a 200,000 view TikTok video the other fucking day. And guess how many views that translated to YouTube? 30. 30 people came from my 200,000 view shitty ass TikTok that somehow got picked up in their shit fucking trash algorithm. I put a 17 second clip of my actual paranormal video on TikTok. 200,000 views. Fuck YouTube. I mean, fuck TikTok. Another thing, networking. Uh, you know, networking with your, your fellow creators. Now, you don't want to network with someone who actually, you know, has uh, 10,000 views, 10,000 subscribers. You want to network with someone who's got like at least like 10 million subs, 10 million subscribers. Then you'll maybe get like a, a tenth or like a 1,000th of what they have. That's what you want to do. Tag them, DM them on Twitter, email them, fucking spam them the hell out. Harass them. I mean, don't harass them. That's bad. But spam them. Spam them on every fucking platform you have. You want to basically antagonize people. What do you have to lose other than to be a piece of shit? How to network with other YouTubers. Hey, what's up, Mr. Beast? It's actually Rindy here, not Marshmallow. Uh, but I would be down for you investing in my channel. I would change this picture of George W. Bush here. I would change it to a picture of your face. Not only would you get 10% of my channel, but your face would be hanging from my toilet cage right there. I hope you consider Mr. Beast. I will change my name to physically Rindy when I hit 1 million subs. And I know Mr. Beast, you're the, you're the only man who can help me do this. You're the only YouTuber, the only man who has any following that can help me get to 1 million subscribers. Please Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. I'm on my knees right now. Mr. Beast, I'm on my knees right now for you. Mr. Beast, please, give me your money, Mr. Beast. Round of applause for Mr. Beast. Give me your money, Mr. Beast, please. I need, I need all your support, Mr. Beast. I need you to invest in my channel, Mr. Beast. I need everything you own, Mr. Beast. I need me and you. We could be like brothers. We could be like twins. We could be like conjoined twins. We could share the same genitals, Mr. Beast. You and me together. Mr. Beast, please. I'll sit there and I'll think, what can I message Mr. Beast today? What's Mr. Beast up to today? Maybe he's thinking about Rendy. Maybe he's thinking about doing a collab with Rendy. Maybe he's thinking about reinventing his videos to reinvent the YouTube algorithm to stop spamming clickbait trash. I'm gonna spend the next 50 hours buried alive in this coffin. I'm gonna give you an example of networking right now. Idubs is putting out a little boxing championship uh, and he's calling all creators, you know, to, uh, to fucking come slam him. And if you get on this boxing video, you're gonna easily pick up like a 100,000 followers. So what you gotta do is you don't respond to his tweet where he's calling out for content creators with a fucking message. That's fucking lame. What you wanna do is you wanna fucking, God damn, I'm lightheaded. Fuck! You want to reply to the tweet with a hilarious memory of a video, like you're on fucking Snapchat, right? So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna make the video now. Let's see how it performs. 200 plus likes, not bad. What's up, iDubs? It's your boy, Rindy here. I've got about 100,000 subscribers, 125,000 subscribers on YouTube. I've been really wanting to get knocked out. I mean, I really wanted to knock out some people lately. Mm. 
you know I've, I've been really having some pent up anger uh, I want to break someone's jaw I want to bust some fucking teeth out and shit man so if you could please give me the opportunity to do just that I would uh, really appreciate it man I'm like a mile away from my car right now I'm, I'm thinking about turning around but I'm really pursuing the fact that I'm pushing through I'm persevering Dude, this park has dicks everywhere I don't know why the people of YouTube in this anarchist like society of YouTube us people have the power and I want you to remember that put out what you enjoy as long as it's not clickbait trash that's put out to get money and a lot of fucking fans because you want to put out stuff that'll get no views I mean you want to put out stuff that you enjoy please I need views I need money this is the guy you want as the next face of YouTube right here. This is it. This is who you want. We all, we are all the YouTube algorithm. The YouTube algorithm is us. The YouTube algorithm. It's quite a thing. You know, the YouTube algorithm, how you can beat it. The YouTube, how you beat the YouTube algorithm is really a, an interesting thing. You just beat it. You just become it. You become the YouTube algorithm. Eventually, me, I will be like metamorphosizing into the YouTube algorithm. We are the algorithm. This has to be at the top of the search engine. This has to be. Fuck the YouTube algorithm, fuck YouTube, fuck TikTok, fuck Shane Dawson, fuck Mr. Beast. They're all ruining the algorithm. The YouTube algorithm. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. I'm almost back to the car. I'm exhausted, dizzy, feeling like shit. That was today's goal as well. We're gonna beat the YouTube algorithm. See you guys then.